Hey Internet, I'm Mike and I have opinions. Comic books. I came relatively late to the comics world while I was in high school. That may seem odd, but it was early to mid 90s and it was the time of event comics. Even more so than today. What brought me in was the death of Superman. Well, to be more precise, it was one of the Bloodline annuals. Yeah, I know, right? If you don't know about Bloodlines, it was, well, in retrospect, it was terrible. Aliens show up on Earth and proceed to snack on people's spinal fluid, which somehow activated the victim's latent superpowers. No, I'm not at all kidding. Go look it up. Hell, the Bloodlines aliens were basically ripoffs of the monster from Alien. They even have the second set of jaws they used to suck out the fluids. Oh god, and the powers people get from this... <laughs> the only good character that I remember anyway was Tommy Monahan. Star of the book Hitman. By Garth Ennis. He was created in a crappy 90s crossover. I just blew your mind. Anyway, that was my intro to comics. Why I stayed still baffles me, but I think it wasn't the story. It was the idea of this dude in armor starring in a Superman comic. Why did a couple of people call him Superman? So, a couple of days later, I saw a bundle at Walmart, of all places, of the death of Superman and Fuel for a Friend. I was hooked. Say what you want about Death of Superman, but what followed was some of the best comics I've read. Funeral is a bloody love letter to the character. If anything from that era could make you fall in love with the character, that sure as hell could. I still read comics today, 20 years later. Not nearly as many, though. In fact, the last regular book I was reading, Legion of Superheroes, was just cancelled. I'll detail that series next time. Suffice it to say, I'm not a fan of the whole New 52 thing. The first few issues of Morrison's Action Comics reboot were good, but then he lost me as he wandered yet again into Crazy Land. The rest of the line... It's just not really for me anymore. I'll still read stuff like Atomic Robo, which everybody should be reading, damn it, but until the inevitable Legion reboot, that's it. If you guys want to recommend any comics I ought to be reading, please let me know in the comments. Until next time, I have opinions, and so should you.